Today we are opening this massive box. What's up guys, today we're opening a massive box of cards that I'm gonna be selling for someone. So I'm not exactly sure what's in here, but I know there's a lot of fire cards. Like there's graded cards, there's ungraded cards. Keep an eye out, if you guys are interested in anything, this stuff is gonna be for sale. Before we open the box, we do have a quick giveaway. I'll be giving away these three cards. All you have to do is like this video, be subscribed, let me know your favorite card you see in here. There's an absolute ton. I don't know how long this is gonna take, but let's get into it. It looks like you guys are in luck because there's a giveaway of an entire sealed legendary decks here. Legendary hero decks. You guys can win this. Do the same thing I said before. Like the video, be subscribed, let me know your favorite thing in here. It looks like he has a duelist saga in here. I might just buy this myself and open this up for a video because this would be super fun. This set is incredible. This is fun. This is like a mystery box. Here we go. I know there are graded cards in here. I specifically remember that. We've been talking about this for a while and he just sent it. Oh, no. whoa. Is this retro pack? This is the legendary Retro Pack 2. I forgot how much sealed stuff he had. All right, Retro Pack 2. Okay, uh, the sealed stuff, you can ask about it. We'll see if I bought it or not. We'll, we'll figure it out, but wow. Retro Pack 2. This thing is in minty condition. I've never seen one this nice. Like, normally they're all curled up or whatever, but this one is very, very nice. This one is quite heavy, so let's see what this is. Maybe this is just a bunch of cards. That's probably why it's so heavy. This is extremely well packaged overall, which makes sense since it is pretty expensive. Oh, okay, it's more sealed stuff. It's oh, the Jade and Yuki. Oh, I've never actually had these before. These are cool. The Jade and Yuki, the Chad. Jesse Anderson. We've got Jaden Yuki again. That's Jaden Yuki too. Okay, cool. So those are two different ones. So that's pretty cool. These definitely seem like cards, right? Yeah, okay. Cards, 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 cards. Here we go. All right, let's check this out. Majestic Dragon, Gateway of the Six, Night of the Red Lotus. All right, a lot of Stardust Overdrive Unlimited. Let's see. We're going to go through these a little bit quick. This card's actually pretty expensive now. It's Preparation of Rights. Um, kind of hard to get these at the right angle. There we go. White Chimera. There's some ultis. Got the Psychic Nightmare. Pull that guy a few times. Okay, we get some secrets in here. Effect Veiler. That's an Ultra Rare from D-Rev. That's actually really expensive now because Effect Veiler's gotten really popular in the current format. Solemn Warnings. More Veilers. Is there an Ulti Veiler in here, please? That would be awesome. Okay, we got some more Commons and Supers. Okay. Oh, those are Supers. Oh, Dark Soul First Dead. Wow, okay. That's that's a good card. Fernity Doom Dragon. Blackwing Dragon Ulti. Oh, Oh, okay. Gawky Miro, Saber Vault, uh, Sniffus, Into the Void. There's a lot of nice cards. We've got the uh, the Sniff Man. We've got Intercept Wave. We've got a lot of those. Infernity Doom is a pretty cool card. Oh, Infernity Mirage is a good one for sure. You got a reprint, but it's still pretty valuable in the Super Rare. Bogger, another Infernity Doom. Wow, there's a lot of good cards. Super Poly Secret Rare, nice. Elemental or Avian, Alt Art. Love that. So the Legendary Collection GX stuff. And Heated Heart. We got the Hero. That looks really good. First Edition. Super Poly First Edition. These are Royal Mega Pack cards. These are all really cool. Malicious Secret Rares. Those are nice. Oh, look. The Heated Heart is uh, a little bit jacked up there. Instant Fusions. Lumina. Gladiator Beast. And Crystal Beacon. Cool. We got some more good stuff here. Yeah. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> I don't even know what we're going to do about these, these raw cards. But... We'll figure it out. Force of the Breaker. Cool. Soul on Fire. Haven't opened a lot of that. Volcanic Doom Fire. We do have the ulti of that. It's a little bent, but uh, <laughs> so cool. Ryza. Ooh, does he have an ulti, Ryza? That would be cool. Volcanic Shell. That's a cool one. Captain Gold ultis. Wow, look at all these ultis. Oh, this is sick. This is awesome. We've got the uh, Light of Destruction. Cool. Phantom Dragon. Solar Recharge. Oh, that's nice for the... Uh, you know, the lights were stuff. Ooh, secret rares. We've got the angel. We got any honests in here? We'll see, I guess. Divine dragon. Magical exemplar. Union attack. Dual links. Let's go. Raiko's cool. Jinzo lord. More Raiko. Ooh, whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. This is a card I don't own, so this might be a cool one. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's got that Rise of Destiny scuffing, but this is a sick card, yeah. Yeah, we might be uh, might be picking this one up myself. That is a really iconic card. Just everyone used to think it was so good, you know, when you're a kid. It's not actually good, but it looks awesome. Divine Wrath. <laughs> He's got a creator in here. This card was cheap for so long. I think it's pretty expensive now, but it was cheap for a long time. Wow, the perfect Machine King. That's awesome. All right, we got a long way to go here. A lot of good stuff left. Like, we are not even close to done. Like, we've got all these raw cards, and there's a lot more in this box. So this might be a longer video. Sit back and enjoy it. I love these epic collections. 
This man, oh, the legendary clock tower prison. I have three PSA 10s of that. Oh, we used to have a PSA 10 of that a long time ago. Oh, does he have a Dreadmaster ult? Does he have the legendary <laughs> elemental hero? You know. Oh, Master of Oz, cool. Armed Dragons. Oh, Horus. Oh, this is so awesome, Horus. Some of these ultis I do not have in my collection, so I might be swiping these up. Vanity's Fiend, very nice. Man, some of these cards are awesome. Cyberdark Dragon. We do have that, unfortunately. We have that guy. Uh, Cyber stuff. Cyberdark Dark Cities. Cool. D Chain. Neo Space. Alien Mother. Destiny Hero Dogma and Aqua Dolphin. Some nice POTD stuff. We have more POTD. We have the Neo Space Flare Scare. We got the Dark Neos Ultra Rare. Very good. Aqua Dolphins. Wow. Check these out. These are so cool. We opened it. Remember when we opened a whole case of POT? It wasn't a case technically, but it basically was the equivalent of a case. Live stream. That was so cool. <gasps> oh, I need this Phoenix Wing Wind Blast. Oh my gosh. That card is so epic for Go format and it looks so good. Oh yeah. Big Tusk, man. We pulled this in the every pack opening. Silent Swordsman. Oh, if that's an ulti, we got to get that. Gatling Drag. This card's expensive, even an ultra rare. The commons are like $15. It's insane. Blast Magician. Oh, Blast Magician is a good one. Lightning Vortex is... Man, Flaming Eternity has some of the best looking cards. They're absolutely amazing. All right, Kazaki Self-Destruct. Oh, not as many ultis from, from uh, Flaming Eternity as I was hoping. Let's see the Wing Karibo. Do we got a Wing Karibo ulti? That'd be cool. Master Monk. Oh, Ghost Rare Blue Eyes. Getting the new one in Ghost from the Past. Super exciting. This is still really cool. Elder Entity Intis. Very good one. Alistair the Invoker. Yeah, Kitchen Dragon Maid. A lot of decent gold cards there. Uh, we've got some uh, Japanese OCG. Oh, there's the ulti. We pulled this one. That This is out of the Egyptian God Box. The Shooting Star Dragon. Tour Guide. we got the Dragon Maids. Maybe check out the next week of auction series if you're a big Dragon Maid fan. Dark Magician Girl. Cool. Wait, this is the Yap. Oh, that's okay, That's where we got the art. Cool. Kaiku. Oh, some old, like, actual old school. Like, before it's been, like, GX era and stuff like that. 5Ds. Very nice. Judgment. Vampire Lords. These are all from his Rise of Destiny. That's what those are from. All right. Vamp Lord. Yeah, more Rise. Okay. Reprint packs. Here we go. Blue Eyes White Dragon. Red Eyes. We got the Trihorn Dragon Left Arm. Okay. These are just rares, so nothing too crazy there. Oh, Decoy Cheese. Oh, these are good. All right. The rest of the box is like common, so we're going to pass on those and go to the rest of it. There is another thousand card box. Is this more singles? We're about to Oh my gosh. If they're as good as the last one, this is going to be crazy. Okay, let's see. We have, uh, looks like Gold Series. Okay, there's some good stuff in here. Gold Series, Dark Arm Dragon, Caius. I mean, oh my gosh, such cool cards. These aren't like crazy valuable from what I know. They could be, they're probably actually decent, but um, still, man, Mirror Force, MST, Lone Fire, Jinzo, Galaxy Eyes. I mean, just almost every card in Gold Series is good. We got Breaker, we got Ancient Fairy Dragon, Alt Art. I kind of forgot that existed. Visionary Vine. Oh, we're in Dusa now. Okay, yeah, it looks like you opened a lot of Dusa. Because, you know, he has the sealed one and all this stuff. I remember I opened two boxes of Dusa because they were super cheap back then. This card is pretty expensive, but it just got the reprint in gold. But I opened a ton of Dusa and it was really fun back in like 2018. Maybe effect veilers are probably worth a lot. Even though the Dusa rarity is kind of up for debate if people like it or not. I still like it. Oh, Gale. Nice. Black <laughs> Blackluster Soldiers in here. Ooh, Mask Hero Dark Law. It's one of the only... I mean, it doesn't have a lot of prints. Maybe like four or something. All right, let's see what else we got. We're going to go kind of quickly until we see something crazy because there is a lot to go through in this video. I don't want it to be like, you know, an hour long because I have to edit this. <laughs> if someone else was editing it, sure, we'd go all day, but I have to edit this thing, so I'm not trying to die. All right, this looks like it. Yeah, we're in Sassy Strike, uh, Savage Strike, I should say. So we'll see if there's anything too crazy. These are all super, so they're not going to be worth much. Um, Hero Lives, cool. We're back to do so, it looks like. Harvey's Feather. Oh, yeah, I love Grapha. Very cool. Ebryonic. We're back to Gold Series 4. Okay. Chaos Sorcerer. This is where it's like the, the brown rarity that people don't like. And honestly, I, I don't blame them for not liking this one. The original Gold Series, though, looks great. So you can't hit on that thing. That thing looks good. I think I saw some more like epic, epic stuff. We're DB2. Okay. DB2 Supers. Gemini Imps. We got all this. Oh, we got some more. Uh, we got uh, the... We got two of these, Magician of Black Chaos, which is cool from Premium Pack. Not a huge Premium Pack guy, but I do like the Magician of Black Chaos. It's a very cool card, Secret Rare. Okay, there's a lot of this. We've got mm, DRL3. Okay, cool. The Dark Magician Girl, the Dragon Knight, is like a super in here. Yeah, no, an Ultra. Okay, an Ultra. There it is. We've got, ooh, ooh DPO6. I thought that was glass. I was like, whoa. Okay, Apprentice Illusion's good. 
Oh, ultis. Yeah, these are from the tin, right? No, Galactic Overlord. All right. Ex oh, Exastag. All right, there's some cool cards. C101, Utopia Roots. Goyo. Oh, Goyo Guardian, Montage. Dra oh, wait, do we have Stardust in here? Zombie Master. And probably not. It seems like, like the best, best cards were pulled out. There's still like a lot of good ones in here. Speaking of good ones, Frost and Flame Dragon from Tactical Evolution. Two of those. Phenomenaga. Cyberdark Impact. Cool. I've never been able to pull this. Rainbow Dragon. Crystal Seer. Awesome. Necro Garden. Uh, Zombie Master. Aquarian Alessa. D-Boys. Everybody loves that card. Shard of Greed. Oh, that's it. That's a Duel Links Classic. Ultra Rare or Super Rare in the first set ever. Okay. Uh, Friller. Emergency Teleport. This is probably 20 bucks now because the $10 out of uh, goes for the past reprint. So I def it's definitely a lot. Vision Hero Adoration. We've got the Imperial Tomb. C101. Sector stat. What was this? Neo. Okay. Photon. Photon Strike Bouncer. That's a pretty good card. Cool. Oh, Rescue Cat. It looks like it's a little warped, but I bet this is like an $80 card. That's a very expensive card. Invocation just got the reprint, though. Still cool to get the secret of the uh, Papal Operative. Slushy. Slushy. All right. Very cool. Very cool. Let's gonna go through the... Man. Oh, yeah. The Infantry. One of my favorite dueling decks is that Water XC's deck. It's really, really good. So uh, that's a good card in it. Cyber Dragon Infinity. Tuning. We're going to go even faster because it looks like these are somewhat new. Twin Twisters are a good card, so good to see. We're going to go very f Void Vanishment. This card, I think, got a reprint finally, but it was like a $10 super out of there. Also, by the way, if you are interested in something, do me a favor and don't be like, can I get that one $1 card, you know, that's in the middle of the whole thing? Like, maybe if you want to get, like, a cheap card, get a few cards just so it's, like, I don't have to go searching for, like, a 50-cent card or something like that. That would... I would really appreciate that because that is always a pain when that happens. But, oh, the Chocolate. Look how cute they are. Look at them. Down there with the hoot cake. Gotta love it. Best card ever. Besides, of course, the Pecanio Moth. We got the... Oh, Rainbow. What is on him? Did he get written on? Rainbow from Stan. Cool. Oh, gotta love the Dark Worlds. I like playing those in Duel Links. They're not very good, but they're fun. Amaterasu. Forbidden Scripture. Amaterasu again. Oh, there's two cards in there. All right, Vampire Vamp. Ah, oh, the Pudding Cess. The number 91. Okay, a lot of these cards are pretty good. I mean, this is like a $10 Super Victory is. Um, Dyson Sphere is pretty good. Bahamut Shark's a big money card. That's in the uh, Duel Links Exceeds deck as well. Abyss Dweller, of course. Yeah, that's, that's a pretty expensive card here, too. Ah, the old sword. The one you never wanted to pull from Toon Chaos. There it is. Quick booster. Ah, the Abysteus. Cool. A lot of uh, a lot of water stuff. We got the Heart Earth Dragon. These are not... There we go. I was about to say scrolling. I don't know if that's the right word for actual physical cards, but that's funny. Uh, ooh, Blackwing Armor Master. Cool for those Black Wings. Life Force Harmonizer. Doom Kaiser always looked really cool. I don't think he's worth too much. Tap this. We got the Plague Spreader. Is awesome. That's a good card for sure. Psychokinesis. Wait, is that another Plague Spreader? That's Ultra. Okay. Uh, Battle Mania, Red Ogre, and Overmind Archfiend. All right, TG Blade Blaster. Wow, there's just so many, so many nice cards in here. Like, everything's pretty nice. Elf and the Raven, Trident Dragon, Power Tool Dragon, Lighten Dragon, Harden Armor. Forbidden Chalice is a pretty big card in the meta right now, so I bet that's pretty expensive. Uh, if there's an ulti in here, that's that's big money. Power Tool Dragon, is that a Secret Rare or an Ultra? Ultra, okay. Um, so that's from the set. Let's keep going. More supers, Blackwing Armor Master, Shop Swallow's Nest, Ugh, Harpies. All right, Scrap Breaker. We got the, ooh, the Six Samurai Sheen. Very good card. We got these guys. Oh, Ulti Sheen. That's cool. I like that one. We got the Scrap Breaker. We got the Anishi. That's a nice one as well. So pretty good uh, store stuff. The last of this box, we got a couple more stacks here. Forbidden Lance is pretty good. Dark Voltanis, Blackwing Armor Master, Bone Crusher. Totem Dragon, Scanner, Alien Kid, Black Salvo, Ancient Fairy Dragon, cool, Gotems, Gotems, Gaia, Card Blocker, Ancient Sacred Wyvern, very good. Then we've got yeah, those, we've got the Gaia Plate, Ancient Fairy Dragons, Saber Slash, oh, Jester Cough, it's actually expensive as a super, so that's a good one. Um, Saber Slash again, another Jester, very good. Ultimate Rare, good. Silver Wind is very cool looking. I always like that one. Ice Queen, Clear Vice, Shut Noji. Ooh, the Archlord Christia. Cool. Um, the Guardian Yatos. It's also Magician. A lot of good stuff in here. We have another huge box. Uh, there's still graded cards to come, so keep keep your eyes open for that. Or just stay with us. We have some... Are these McDonald's packs? McDonald's packs? Oh, that's pretty big, actually. I might want to open those. That's cool. 
We have the Super Starter Space Time Showdown. Okay. We have the Dragons of Legend Unleashed. This is Dragons of Legend 3, I believe. We have Dragons of Legend 2, which can have the Toon Kingdom, which is a big card. Another Unleashed Booster Box. Oh, here's a big one. Uh, first Edition Labyrinth of Nightmare. Okay, that's a pretty big one. Maybe we do a box break with this because Gemini Elf would be awesome. Ooh, Toon Chaos First Edition. You'll love to see this. This is a nice box. And then we have, ooh, Dimension of Chaos. One of my favorite boxes. I kind of want these for one of these for my collection. Okay, this is a nice box. And not only do we have one, we have two. These are actually really hard boxes to find. If you guys remember when we opened all those packs. Wow, Dimension of Chaos. I kind of forgot that was in there. We are on to the main event, the graded card. So if you go oh, a little peek, little sneak peek in there, we can't really see them. But this is a Barrel Dragon first edition PSA 10. So this is the kind of stuff we're looking at. We're looking at some really nice cards. So you guys, especially these PSA cards, because they're the easiest to sell. We don't have to dig through a bunch of stuff. We only have a certain amount of these. So if you guys are interested in these, hit me up, Instagram, Twitter, email, all that stuff. There's like a lot. There's like 30 cards. So let's just, uh, let's slowly get into it. They are all in these wrappings. I mean, he packaged this thing like the best packaging I've ever seen. Probably <laughs> they're wrapped up. They're in boxes. They're in other boxes. You know, they're in multiple boxes. Here we go. Forceful Century, PSA 10 for Magic Ruler. Quality stuff. We have, oh, an old cert. Toon Summon Skull. Okay. MRL PSA 10. We're looking at PSA 10 stuff right now, which is pretty awesome. Graded 10s. All right. What is going to be next? The four certs. So we're all over the map. We have Blue Eyes Toon Dragon. We are looking at some really, really nice cards right now. That is four PSA 10s of old Magic Ruler and Metal Raider sets. Next pack. A pack, whatever you call this. It's like a mystery box. Oh, Imperial Order. PSV First Edition. Okay, very nice. This is just like a massive mystery box of random, like graded, ungraded. It's awesome. This is so much fun to open. We have Sangha of the Thunder. PSA 10. Super rare. And we have Tribute to the Doomed. Metal Raiders First Edition. Very nice. Wow, we're talking like old school stuff here, and these are pretty nice. Limiter removal, Pharaoh Servant. That's our newest card yet. We've got a two that we haven't left 2002 yet, though, but this is pretty cool. All right, we have next. Oh, this is a little bunched up, but that's just the case. The Backup Soldier PSV PSA 10. Then we have the Seven Tools of the Bandit. This is a cool one. I like this card. It's always the one you never want to pull, but it's still a cool card. And the next card we have. Defensive Tactics VSA 10 Ultimate Rare. That's funny. We've got End of Anubis, the Ancient Sanctuary Secret Rare. Very nice. All right, guys, I went ahead and removed all these from their packaging because it was taking forever. So we're going to do these one at a time. We have Exoplasm or Ultimate Rare PSA 10. There's a ton of them left. And then there's also more cards I realized they have. <laughs> Judgment of an or Curse of Anubis. Sorry, different card. Kazijin PSA 10. Cool. We've got the X Head Cannon. Very nice. Super Rare from Magician's Force. These are all 10s. We've got the YZ Tank Cannon. I don't know if he even owns anything that's not a 10. This is crazy. Well, in terms of graded, because obviously the ungraded stuff is not a 10. All right. Ugarnesia Lafontis. One of the worst one of the worst foils in general for Metal Raiders, but still cool. This is a big one. Haunted Mine Ghost Rare. The pop on this thing is tiny. Let's see if the foil actually looks good. You guys see anything wrong with it? Okay, those scratches, I think, are on the case right there. But wow, a Gem Mint 10 from Hot in Mind. These are very, very hard to find. Very valuable cards. That is nice. But they aren't printing the new Ghost right now. We've got the Serpent Knight Dragon First Edition. That's cool. Uh, Chthonian Dragon. Love to see that. Chthonian Emperor Dragon, I should say. Buster Blader PSA 10. Whoa, there are some big cards in here. Some absolutely huge cards. All right, Berserk Dragon. That was one of the first cards I graded. Not that specific one, but... Arch, oh, Skull Archfiend of Lightning, one of my favorite cards. The Ultimate Tyranno, that's very cool. Ultimate, Ultimate Tyranno. <laughs> Time Wizard, BSA 10, that's so cool. The Time Wizard, love to see that one. Harpy Lady Sisters, very good. Sanctuary in the Sky. We've got Mask of Dispel. Got the, oh, Ancient Sanctuary cover card. The Archlord Zerato, that's a cool one. Then the Fiber Jar, that's also a good one. Horus the Black Flame Dragon, if that was ulti, that would be insane, even though it's level 6. Mystical Space Typhoon, PSA 10. We've got the Exodia Necros, PSA 10. That's so cool. That is one that I've never gotten somehow from Dark Christ. I used to have a 9.5, but I never got the 10. And then, a Toon Mermaid, PSA 10. 
and that's not even it for the video then we have the stack of top loaders. these are the last cards we have let's see they're probably nice cards uh extra have had the tape on it so we'll, we'll get it out but we're gonna do that later then we have a in was on the other side so we will get those out of the tape later but we have to check these other ones out herald of perfection curse of dragon first edition lob all right not bad barrel dragon first edition so we have a psa 10 we have a raw copy oh ghost rare red dragon archfiend so we are not kidding around we have the gold rare dark magician girl let's go like this celtic guardian first edition lob flame swordsman first edition lob yada grossin first edition uh legacy of darkness genzo first edition psv First edition Summon Skull, First Edition Relinquish, Glomios Ulti, Wild Wingman Ulti, Doriato Ulti, Wing. There was another one in there that's not uh, top loaded, interesting. And then the Ulti uh, Galaxy Ice Prime Photon Dragon. Wow, this is like, it just doesn't stop. Wing Dragon of Raw, awesome. Beast Skull First Edition, Dark Piercing Light. I don't know what conditions these are, but man, these are nice. Wow, Obnoxious Celtic. I guess they weren't good enough to grade, but there's first edition, that was nice. Solemn Judgment. Oh my goodness, this is insane. Toon Table. Toon Table, Obelisk, Wing Dragon of Raw, Blackluster Soldier, Cosmo Queen, Millennium Shield, let's go! The Dark Magician Girl, Maj oh, Majestic, that's big. Draco Knight, Equist, Solemn, and another Majestic Star Dragon. And finally, we have the, oh, the Collector Rare Gamma. We got the Toon Kingdom, I was talking about that earlier. SDJ, Mimi Cat, we've got the DMG, there's another Ghost Rare, or Gold, Gold Ghost Rare, Blue Eyes. Psyche Wheeler and the Toon Bookmark. Wow, what an insane box. If you guys enjoyed that epic opening, make sure to subscribe and like the video because we're going to be doing more epic stuff like this in the future. If you guys are interested, especially in the big cards, hit me up. Shout out to TCG, Trusted Cards, Tone Fo Show, Tomato Juice, Noah J, Hawaiian, Yu-Gi-Oh, Stanley, Mike Nance, Mimic Gecko, and Duelist Kingdom Cards. Thank you guys for supporting the channel, and I will see you guys next time. Peace.